Liv, what is your partner pet peeve? What's the one thing that really annoys you about your partner? The one thing that he does that drives me bananas is that he picks the worst possible time to ask to go for a run. Because you do a Sunday planning meeting where you guys get to sort of know where you guys are going to be exercising for the week, right? The reason that we do Sunday planning meeting yep. is because of this story. Right. In our household, we have two small children. It's action-packed <laughs> at our house at all times. And when you travel with children, as people with kids know, it is an Olympic sport yeah. packing for an event. And Stratty, uh, we had about 40 minutes to go until the barge was leaving. So we had to leave our house, had to get down to Brizzy, get on that barge. So time of the essence. Yeah, right. I had both kids running around, had Jack asking me why I didn't have a dicky for starters. I don't have time to answer that. I've got Callie screaming because she has teeth coming through and wants to be physically attached to me at all times. So now I've got one hand operating, okay? I've got Callie, I've got one hand, I've got Jack. I'm trying to have a conversation with him at the same time. It's a lot. The car needs to be packed, okay? We need eskies. We need a full grocery shop for the four nights. I need uh, baby beds. I need docker tots. I need carriers. I need clothes for everybody. So this is all going through my head, the mum list, okay? Yeah, right, of course. Where's Nick? Don't know, couldn't tell you. Nowhere to be seen. Probably on the toilet. Who knows? And he comes out. So I'm f- frantic at this point, and I'm yeah. trying to I'm trying to put the surfboards on the top. Like it's all happening. And Nick pops his head in. I've looked at it. I'm like, okay, Ron, he's made an appearance now. Hey, babe. Uh, and I've got a list of things I want him to do. And he's like, can I go for a trot? Don't. I, no. I no, he didn't. Can you do a what now? Sorry, hun. But anyway, I oh. l- I said okay because it was going to be a whole thing, and he knows as well that I'm at my absolute peak anxiety when we're packing to go somewhere. I'm sweating I'm, for you. Anyway, let Nick go for the run because I'm a wonderful wife. And by the time he finished, I said, you need to be in the car by this point, like 8.30. 8.30 on the dot, in the car. So that means no showers. No, He hasn't even packed his bag at this point. Oh, my God. Of course he hasn't. (gasps) So anyway, he manages to get home. I think it was like Mm 8.29. And I'm in the car. Both children are screaming in the back. Everything's packed. I'm sweating. And I see him roll in. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> so hence the Sunday night planning meeting. Uh, but anyway, Sunday night meeting, what we do is, and I, honestly, this, this is a team saver, this idea here. It's a, a family's a small business, right? For a small business, you have a weekly meeting. You oh. want to talk budget. You want to talk. <laughs> <laughs> Look at I don't She's at like, all. <laughs> and I find this hilarious that you do because you are so planned and prepared. And this is just not my jam. So you're teaching me a lot, Liv. <laughs> okay. Well, good. We got ourselves a little target whiteboard. Stop it. With Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday on it. And I was like, right, we need three workouts each and we've got to put them on the board. The board is now gospel, right? If it's on the board, it's in stone. Okay. If I've got gym at 6.30 on a Wednesday morning, I've got gym at 6.30 on a Wednesday morning, which means you're watching the kids, I'm yep. going to gym. And his runs are in there. They're scheduled. They're ahead of time. Okay. I know when they're going to be, so I'm not going to blow up because I've got 40 minutes to pack the car. Yeah, And everyone's call. asking me questions and I need him to help me. Like, yeah. So it's all organized. Uh, communication is key. It I is. I think that's the message here. Families folks. are small businesses. Yeah. <laughs> so you run. Do you no, want, do you want to be married to no. me? No. 